Every parent wants the best for their child and there's no exception when it comes to safety whilst travelling. So it's important to make sure that you have your child in the right restraint at the right time. The law requires children between six months and four years of age to be restrained in either an approved rearward facing restraint or a forward facing child safety seat, which is a seat with an inbuilt harness. They must also be in the rear row where the vehicle has two or more rows of seats. Parents have a few options to choose from for this age group, including a convertible child safety seat fitted in the rear facing mode, a forward facing child safety seat or a combination seat. That is a child safety seat that converts to a booster seat. Although the law only requires a child to be rear facing until six months, research shows that best practice is to keep them rear facing until about 12 months of age. REA recommends using a rear facing safety seat rated to 12 months, such as this one. Use the restraint rearward facing until the child has reached the maximum weight or height requirement for this mode. Once this has been reached, turn forward facing and use until the child reaches the maximum weight or height for the restraint. When choosing a child restraint, make sure it is suitable for the size of your vehicle, is easy to use and it has good head protection. When looking for a convertible safety seat, look for one that will take your child up to 12 months of age rearward facing and it is tall enough to accommodate your child up to four years of age. In a convertible seat made to the old standard, such as this one, use the restraint rear facing until the child reaches the maximum weight for this mode. After converting to the forward facing mode, use the restraint until the child reaches the maximum weight for the seat or their shoulders go past the top harness slot. In a convertible seat made to the new standard such as this one, use rear facing until the child is at least 12 months of age and their shoulders have exceeded the minimum shoulder height marker. After converting to the forward facing mode, use until the child's shoulders reach the top shoulder height marker and this should occur around four years of age. To install a convertible child safety seat rearward facing, Adjust the harnesses so they sit level with or just above the child's shoulders. Select the rearward facing angle, pull out the stabilising bar, lengthen the upper tether strap, place the restraint on the vehicle seat facing the back and feed the seat belt through like so. Make sure that there are no twists or slack. Click in the seat belt. Push weight into the base of the restraint while removing all slack from the seat belt. Where possible, lock in the seat belt to maintain firmness of installation. Automatic locking seat belts can be locked like this. Inertia reel seat belts can be locked like this. Attach the upper tether strap to the anchorage point. If you're unsure about the location of the anchorage point, check the vehicle's manual. If the strap is not long enough to reach, an extension strap will need to be added. Place the baby in the restraint, do up the harness, making sure there are no twists, and adjust the harness so that it is firm. Firm up the upper tether strap, making sure not to over tighten. If the restraint is lifted off the vehicle seat, then loosen off the upper tether strap. Finally, make sure there is a gap between the restraint and the front seats. Always follow the manufacturer's instructions and if you have any questions about the installation, contact RAA's Safety Centre for advice.